Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel and thank you for tuning in. As always, my videos are all about strategy and analysis, helping you make a smarter decision with your investment. In today's video, we will be taking a close look at MSTY, one of the top performing DM Max ETF. We will explore different strategies, break down the numbers to see which one of these strategies can get the most of our investment in MSTY. So if you're looking to get the most of the ETF, you are in the right place. So if you go to the Yield Max ETF website, right, I mean, say, and looking at the MSTY. So if you look at MSTY, the underlying stock is MSTY, right, macro strategy. And what does macro strategy does? Even though macro strategy is a software company, but it holds a large number of Bitcoin, almost a $10 billion. Because of that, MSTR, macro strategy is considered as a proxy to Bitcoin. So if the Bitcoin goes up, macro strategy goes up. If Bitcoin go down, macro strategy go down. So it's directly correlated with that. So what are we going to be doing in this video is we'll be looking at these five different strategies, right? So since the underlying stock is MSTR, so first we will look at MSTR stock. All we do is we'll just buy simple, buy and hold it, right? MSTR. Now the second strategy is okay. MSTR is a proxy for Bitcoin. So let's see if instead of MSTR, we buy directly Bitcoin. We'll see how does that works out. And then the third one is yield max ETF MST1. We will buy and hold it. The first one, what we do is we will actually cash out the distribution. Right? Every month, macro strategy pays a distribution. So on the strategy number three, we will cash out the distribution. We will take the money and have fun, do whatever you like to do. And the fourth one, I call it drip, right? Dividend reinvestment plan. I will come to that in a second hour, you know, I'll show you the complete analysis. So what we'll be doing is, okay, every month when we get the dividend, so instead of cashing it out, we will reinvest it. We'll buy it more share of MSTY and see how it works out. And the fifth and the last one, I call it like a hopping around, right? The monthly flipping. We will buy it before the distribution is announced and sell it when we receive a payment. So what we will do is we'll look at these five different strategy and see which one of this produce the highest return, right? My goal is always to make the most of every penny that I have. So that is what we will be doing into this video. So one request before I go into the detail of this video, you know, I'm in a mission to have 1,000 subscribers by the end of this month. And I can't do it without your support. So please subscribe, share, like, comment. You know. There's a lot of effort goes into making this video like I have to do a lot of analysis, collect data, um, you know, put everything together, calculation, mathematical and all this, a lot of analysis goes into that. So your help and support by subscribing this channel will be much appreciated. One more thing, I'm not a financial advisor. So I'm not going to tell you what to sell, what to buy, when to sell, when to buy. I'm a mathematician. So what I will be doing is just a pure mathematical analysis. You know, the number never lies. Number is what number is, right? So we'll do this pure mathematical analysis. No opinion, no recommendation, no suggestion, just pure math. So hopefully you will like that. So, all right, so let's get it started. So as I said, we'll be looking to these five different strategies. So what I did is let's do a couple of things. You go over here, go to MSTY. This is Yield Max ETA website. You, um, I went to MSTY. So these are the monthly distribution that was paid, right? Or distribution. The fund was started on 221. So the first day it was traded was 222. So all my calculation will start with February 20 to 2024, right? So that's what you'll see in a second. Now, these are the monthly distribution that was paid on. Next so that's all you need to know. So let's copy this and paste it over here. So over here, so I just copy and paste it over here. 
So now for the sake of simplicity, what I did is I actually transferred this into this uh, Excel format, right? So, so if you look over here, the first distribution was paid on for for eight, right? I mean, the, and the first declaration date was for three. So declaration date for three, it, it was four dollar thirteen cent was paid, right? And so on, September fifth, it was paid one eighty five. Now the next distribution is the will be announced on the third week of October. So there's still time. So, so the total distribution that was paid so far on six month was, if you add all this one up, fifteen dollar eighty one cents. All right. So. So these are the five different strategies we will be looking at and see which one of these produce the highest rate of return. So the first one, let's do the buy and hold MSTR stock. Right? So let's go over here. The strategy number one, MSTR. Right? So as I showed you over here, the first date it traded was February 2022. So I will start with February 2022. Right? So let's take a look at February 2022. So let's go to Yahoo over here, MSTR. Looking over here, you go to historical data. February 2022, let's go to over here, February 2022, 2022, $71.32, right? So the price of MSTR was 71.32. So what that means is if I invest $5,000 on MSTR on February, 2022, I can buy 70.11 share of it. I know very well that we don't trade in fraction, but for the sake of simplicity, I'll just leave it as it is. Now, as of today, right? Today is October 10, 2024. I still have 70.11 share of MSTR. So let's see what the price of it is today. The price of MSTR today is. 183.34, right? 183.34. 183.34. So let me check one more thing. It doesn't, well, yeah, it's 10 to 1 spread, but this is all adjusted for spread, so we don't need to worry about that. Okay, good. Okay, looking away. So if I invested $5,000 on February 22nd on MSTR, which is the underlying stock on MSTY, today, is worth $12,853. It's a whopping profit of $7,800, $157, right? So let's look at the strategy number one over here. Let's take a look over here. Strategy number one over here. We buy and hold MSTR stock, right? So what it does is, okay, right? So $5,000 invested on MSTR is worth $12,800. It's a gain of $7,800, 157% gain, right? That's number one. Let's take a look at the strategy number two. Strategy number two is, what is the strategy number two over here? We buy Bitcoin, right? We buy Bitcoin directly. So if you look at today, the stock price of Bitcoin, right? So, I mean, so if you look at 222nd, you know, you can go over here, Yahoo and Google, wherever you can take a look at this. The price of Bitcoin on February 22nd was $51,312. So we bought 0.1 share of Bitcoin. Now today it's worth sixty thousand six hundred ten dollars. I check it five minutes ago, right? So what that means is the total value of my five thousand dollar investment in Bitcoin on February twenty second is equal to fifty nine oh six, right? A gain of nine hundred and six dollars. So strategy number one, I make seventy eight hundred dollars, which was investing in MSTR. Strategy number two, I invested in. Bitcoin uh, gives me 18% uh, gain. It's still profit, but not as much as strategy number one. Now take a look at the strategy number three. What we're doing is we are buying MSTY, M -S -T -Y, which is yield max ETF for MSTR. Now, as I showed you over here, the monthly distribution are paid. But what we will be doing is in this strategy, we'll be cashing out the monthly distribution. We will just take it or all the distribution that we get on the monthly basis, we will take it out. We will go have fun, enjoy, we'll party. We will spend wherever we want to do it or we invest something else or whatever you want to do is your choice. So let's take a look over here. So in February 22nd, if you go to MSTY, I like guess MSTY. MSTY on the February 22nd, if you do that, 
the price was $21.19. So, and today price is $26.50. So, let's go over here. So, the price of $21.19, right? So, she invested like a $5,000, $5,000 investment with the price of $21.19. We bought the $235.96 share of Misty. And as I showed you over here, today the price is $26.50, right? $26.50. Now, since we bought it in February and we still have it, we didn't sell it. So what's happening is every month we're getting this distribution, right? So April, May, June, July, August, September, we got distribution every month. So total distribution we got so far, what? If you add all this one up, it's $15.81. $15.81, right? So what that means is, we on 1581 distribution and we have 236 share of misty so total is so we earn 37 30 dividend now we own 235 96 share of misty and the price today price is 2653 right i mean 2653 so the total value of the stock is like you know, the stock price today's stock price multiply with number of share we have this eh? so what does that mean so the dividend earned, you add with the market value of the today's stock, is come up to 9990 to the gain of almost like $5,000. So pretty much you double your money into that. And you have this $37, $30. So if you invest $5,000, it's worth $10,000 out of week. $3,700, you already got cash, which you can spend anywhere you want. So let's take a look at the strategy number three. Right? So, so far we look at three different strategies, right? We just bought MSTR. We invest in Bitcoin and we invest in MSD. So the strategy number three was, okay, we invested buy and hold, but all the monthly distribution, we cash it out. The fourth one, I call it DRIP, right? Dividend reinvestment plan. What that means is the distribution that we get every month, instead of taking the cash out, we buy more share, right? So as you go, okay, let's do this, right? So the share price of uh, Misty on 222 was $21.19, right? So if you invest $5,000 and the price is this much, so you, we have 235.96 share of Misty, right? So now, if you look over it, take a look at it. The first distribution was paid on 4 8, right? So 4 8, we get a distribution for $4.13, right? So here it is. 4 8, got a distribution. Dividend paid for $4.13, right? And that day we have 236 share of missing. Now take a let's take a go back on Yahoo and take a look at 48 what the, the stock price was. 48 over here, 48, 48 was 35.90, right? So the stock price was 35.90 now. So we earn 300, I mean we, we have $4.13 dividend paid on every single one of them. So we have 236 of these. So what that means is 413, you multiply with 235.96. We earn $975 distribution. Now, this $974, we don't want the cash out. What we want to do is we want to buy the misty. Yeah, so let's do this, right? So this is the total dollar value that we got. Receive on that one. And the price of the stock on that is 35.90. So we got 200. I mean, 27.14 more share of Misty. So, what does that mean? We started with 235.96 and we purchased to 27.14 more on 48. So, now we have this. So, you have this one. That's when we started with, and we have this many more. So, we started with 263.10, right? So, I'm not going to go through every single one of them. That's will be the total waste of your time. So, let's take one more. So, here's what you can do. Let's take a look over here. The second payment was made on May 8, right? So you go on May 8. On May 8, we have 263 share of Misty, right? Now take a look over here what the price of May 8 is. It's $34.62. So over here, 30, actually May 8, what is the price of Misty? May 8, the price of Misty will be May 8. Oh, yeah, price of Misty will be $29.92, right? So let's do over here 29.92. So how much the dividend we earn is like 252 of this 252 over here. You got it. So 
252, every single one of them, multiply it with number of share we have, we earned that $664 dividend, right? Now, so we have $664 dividend that was earned and the price of this was $29.92, so we bought $22.19. So we started with 263, we earned 22 more, so currently we have 285. So you, so since this is DRIP, Dividend Reinvestment Plan, right? So every month we get, whatever dividend we're getting, instead of getting the cash, we're buying more and more missing. So, so we just keep buying every month, month, month. So as of today, of I say, right? So we started 236 of this, today we have 404.32 Misty share, right? Because we have been in reinvesting the dividend into buying more Misty. And what is the price of Misty today? This price of Misty today is 26.50. Right? So let's go over here. 26.50. So what that, that means is each share of Misty is worth 26.53, and we have 404. So 10,726. So what does that mean? That means $5,000 that we invested on February 22nd on Misty is equal to 10,726 dollars. Value, right? So let's go to over here, strategy number four. So, right, so 10,726. That means a gain of 5,700, that's 114%. So we look at the four different strategies, right? So, so the strategy number one, we bought MSTR. Second, we bought Bitcoin. Third, we bought Misty. And the fourth, we bought Misty, but we keep reinvesting the dividend into buying more and more misty right now the last one the last strategy was monthly pre. what does that mean that means if you look over here what we're going to do on this one is just a day before distribution let's buy misty just we're just trying to flip it around we buy before distribution day so we can get this distribution and as soon as we get the payment we sell it, right so if you look at this declaration date is 43 so we'll buy it on 42 the payment date is 4 8, we will sell it on 4 8. Same over here, right? 6 5, if you buy it on 6 4, you sell it on 6 7. Right? So let's do this. So I did exactly the same thing. You know, $5,000 we started with. Let's see what is the price on 4 2. The right? and declaration date was 4 3, so we will buy it on 4 2. And let's go to Prague over here 4 2. What is the 4 2? April 2 is 41 26. 41 26, we bought in 41 26. And since we're keeping it, we bought it before X dividend date, so we will be getting the distribution at right? $4.13. And we will sell it on 4 8 the day we got a payment. So let's take a look at it. What the price was on 4 8 was $35.90. $35 so, how much the gain of loss? Right? The price we're selling it minus whatever we purchased with, right? plus we got dividend, right? Distribution. That's the loss of. Dollar twenty three, right? So what that means is in the month of April, if we just bought it, we were a flipper. We just bought it because we want to get the distribution money there. We probably end up losing money. So when you buy this any yield max ETF, there is NAV erosion, right? It's actually the value keep going down, 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 right? As you can see from here, right? 35, 29, 24, 26, 20. Same, you can do the, exactly the same thing on the other one, right? And let's just do one more of those, right? Any one of them you can take a look. Let's just take a look at the June 4th, right? Over here, the distribution date was June 5. So we buy a day before that, which is June 4. And the payment date is June 7. So we sell it on June 7. Buy it on June 4, sell it on June 7. And the dividend paid is 3.03. Right? So dividend paid on June 3.03. Let's take a look at what the price on June 4 is. June 4 is 34.44, 34.44. And since we're selling it on June 7, so what the price on June 7 is, let's take a look at the June 7 is 3102, 3102, right? So the same thing with the gain of loss, the selling price minus purchase price plus whatever the distribution is on 39 cents. So what does that mean? That if you are flipping around, right, not every month is profitable. Some months you will make money, some months you will lose money. But overall, if you add all those, right, you only gain 386.84. So let's take a look. Let's put this number over here on the strategy number four. Actually, I'm done with this over here, right? So now let's take a look at this. So we started this five is different strategy, right? One, two, three, four, five. And what we're trying to do is see which one of these give the highest return on our investment. 
So, so but doing all the calculation, right? I went through every single one of them for all single three of these. We did the calculation for trip and the monthly flip, right? And summary of this, if you look at this, the flipping around is not as profitable as other strategies. So this, this is as the flipping around on Misty, I will just, I will cross on, right? I will, I will just, uh, this one is actually no, no to me, right? I mean, say, I will just, uh, let's take a look at this. this actually, right? I'm not gonna, this is, I'm, this is not something we should pursue because this is the lowest rate of return, right? Also looking at the Bitcoin, right? The low is pretty return, right? So even this one, I would just uh, no. There are three strategies that actually pay or give a good return, right? If you invest directly on MSTR, uh, you get the highest rate of return. But if you are one of those who who has to invest in real max ETF, MST, so either you do the cash out monthly or drip dividend reinvestment, the rate of return is. Uh, almost same. Yeah, you get it a bit more on drip, but on the cash out monthly, the advantage is you are getting cash every month, right? You can use that cash for anything you want. As I say, for going to party or you buy investing some other security, whatever it is. So this is the analysis of those five strategies. So hope you like it. And if you did, so please don't forget to share, subscribe, like, comment. And once again, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon with some other video. Thank you and have a wonderful day.